Hi everybody, it's me, Anne Panther. It's almost the end of March, so guess what time it is? It's time for my March favorites. Okay, I'm gonna go ahead and put Panther down now because he's a little antsy. So if you hear a little pitter-patter every once in a while, it's him. So I would like to do a shout out to all the March babies out there. So all the people that I know that are born in March, if I forget anybody, I'm so sorry. Just please forgive me. So let's start with March 10th, my son Christopher, March 11th, Angie, his girlfriend, March 14th, Emily, March 17th, my Aunt Esther, March 18th, my twins Aaron and Ariana, my Uncle Bobby and my Uncle Joe, all on the same day. March 25th is my friend Alfonso Walker Jr. And then March 29th, my mom, Dina Nadal, and all the March babies out there. Like I said, if I forgot somebody, please forgive me, but shout out to all of you. Happy, happy birthday. So on to my March favorites. My favorite YouTuber this month is somebody that my daughter told me about. It's Liza Koshi or Liza Kashi. And her YouTube channel is called Wednesdays with Liza. She is absolutely hilarious. Funny, funny, funny. She dubs herself Brown Girl. She That's Panther. She dubs herself the Brown Girl. Kind of like me. One thing that I absolutely love about Liza is that she does comedy skits and she plays different characters and, and she plays every single one of her characters actually and it's just hilarious. She's very talented, She's she's got great comedic timing and one of the skits that I really enjoy is her battle between the 99 cent store and Target stores. If you haven't seen it, you've got to check it out. I'll link her channel down below and you can check it out. She's super, super funny. And I always look forward to her videos every single week. Again, it's called Wednesdays with Liza. Okay, next we're gonna go on to my favorite device of the month. It's my Fitbit Charge 2. I really, truly, truly love this and I use it when I work out. I use it every day. It's a heart rate and fitness wristband and it tracks your steps, your distance, and active minutes. It also tracks your sleep and how long you've been sleeping as well as how well you've been sleeping. It's definitely very useful and it also tracks your pulse rate. The other thing it tracks is the type of exercises that you do. So if you run or if you bike or if you do any kind of sports, it also tracks that. It connects to GPS, which means it tracks distance as well as your pace. Not sure what the guided breathing sessions are. I think it's a, it's time to take quiet moments perhaps and it even tracks that. And one thing that I find very interesting about this wristband tracker is that it's kind of sarcastic. So if I'm not moving or if I'm sedentary for a while, it actually buzzes me on my wrist and it tells me, hello, get up, start walking. Okay, so maybe not in those terms, but you get my gist. So it's definitely something that I like. It's called the Fitbit Charge 2. And I'll link that product down below as well. And this is no way a sponsored video. It's just something, again, that I like and I'm bringing these things to you. So I'll link that information down below and you can check it out. Another one of my favorites, if you haven't already seen my video from earlier this month, it is the Step 360. I will link that information down below the video that I did earlier this month. The Step 360 is a cross between the stepper and a BOSU ball. So if you're not really familiar with that, 
it is if you remember years back the stepper which is where you'd step up and you do some agility moves and that kind of thing and then the bosu ball is more of a half ball a spherical half ball and it kind of helps with your balance and there's different ways that you could use the step 360 and i demonstrate that in an earlier video so again i'll link that information down below so you could see it and one of the things i like about it is that it helps with balance and strengthening and it also includes a DVD which demonstrates some of the exercises that you could do with this particular fitness equipment. It also comes with resistance bands that you can connect in these little sockets around the Step 360. You could do some lower body and legs and core exercises. You could do upper body with your arms and your shoulders and your back. So I will link that information down below and you can check out my video from earlier this month. Okay, so now on to shows and movies. Let's start with shows. My favorite show this month is the Grace and Frankie show, which is available on Netflix. And we're into season three. And if you haven't seen season one or two, it's also available on Netflix. It's a great series. I think you'll enjoy it. It stars Jane Fonda and Lily Tomlin as well as Martin Sheen and Sam Waterston. And it's an interesting twist. It's about the two male spouses that leave their wives for each other. Think of that for a minute. I'll wait. And these women, Grace and Frankie, become really good friends. And not at first, but they become really good friends and kind of have to rely on one another, lean on one another, and experience life together. They help each other cope with their broken marriages as well as experience all types of different things that happen in their lives with romances or failed romances or children or business, relationships, you name it. They experience it together and it's just so super funny. Okay, on to movies. One of my favorite movies this month is the very big height movie, believe it or not, Beauty and the Beast. And surprisingly, it was fantastically well done. I actually went into the movie theaters a little apprehensive, a little resistant, thinking, oh gosh, it's maybe going to be a little overdone. It's probably not going to be as good as the animated movie. And actually, I enjoyed it quite a bit. If you don't already know, it stars Emma Watson, who was very big and popular in the Harry Potter series and she plays Belle and it also stars Dan Stevens who plays the Beast, Luke Evans who plays Gaston, Josh Gad who plays LeFou and he actually is one of my favorite characters. The movie theater where I saw it was at a Regal Dine-In Theater. First time ever in a dine-in theater and I truly enjoyed it. It had plush leather seats and you could recline the seats and you could actually watch it maybe practically laying down but if you order food at the bar they'll bring the food to your seat you just tell them your seat number so that whole experience from watching the movie to sitting in the theater and the dining theater and these plush leather seats was just fun So on to artists or favorite songs. My favorite song this month is by Katy Perry and Skip Marley called Chained to the Rhythm. And it's a feel good song and it has a super catchy chorus. I'm not going to sing it to you, but it's definitely one that just kind of, you know, as soon as I hear it, it's not like, oh yeah, this is my song. If you haven't already heard the song, here's a small snippet. Okay, and so now the last of my favorites, and you probably already see it in the background, are those wonderful string lights. It's manufactured by a company called Apothecary. It's a 10 foot decorative string light. And this is the box it came in, and I bought this at Ross. And I truly love this string light. And one of the things that I enjoy about it is it has this really cool timer. So I could turn it on, 
and four hours later it'll shut off automatically and then 20 hours later it'll turn back on so it's kind of a neat timer and one thing that I love about this particular string light is that once the lights are all off and I'm ready to go to bed and the lights are on the string of lights just kind of illuminate above it makes it feel as though I'm sleeping under a starlit sky and it's just beautiful well everybody those are my March favorites I hope you enjoyed this video and if you did be sure to give it a thumbs up be sure to comment below tell me which of my favorites is your favorite or tell me one of your favorites for the month of March don't forget to subscribe down below and hit the little bell so anytime we upload a video you'll get notified thank you so much for watching we hope you'll stop by again see you in my next video Thank you for watching. Be sure to comment and like below. And she plays several characters. Really, Pam, I need to do that now. He's eating. He's eating his food. He just, Panther loves to do this with his food. He'll kind of like pat at it for a little bit. Can you hear? He'll pat at it for a little bit and then he'll kind of like get himself prepared and then he'll start eating. So if you hear crunching, oh my God, why now? Why? Lovely. We'll wait.